Hi guys, how's it going? It's May. I'm back. Well, technically I was never gone. I've been here the whole time. I was having major technical difficulties. <sighs> yes, it's extremely annoying to deal with. I have literally tried to record this video, part three, like six times. <sighs> I'm extremely frustrated. It took me so long to get it figured out and back together, got a new computer. I think it's gonna work this time. I mean, clearly if you're seeing this video, it worked. So, I, I mean, I've been super busy with, you know, everything else like coding and, and jujitsu and stuff, but I had tried to record this video like this entire time and it just wasn't working out. Every time I recorded, I would watch the video back and major lag. And it was awful too, because I would have some good content. Like, I was in it, I was feeling it. Play it back. Can't even watch it. <laughs> uh, so, hopefully, this time it worked. And I hope you guys finally enjoy part three to Stray. Let's get into it. Okay, so, like I said, I unfortunately have played this part so many times. But you know what the funny thing is, is I've played it so many times, yeah, I still kind of forget what happens because I'm so busy and I've been trying to stick this in like in between everything that I'm doing in my life. So if I play it and it seems like I know what I'm doing because I've played it like six times already, but at the same time, like I still kind of forget like the other little details and such, so. Yeah, hopefully you guys still enjoy it. I mean, I still enjoy playing it. It's still a fun game. Um, it's just uh, when you played the same part over and over and over and over and over and over again, you know, it seems a little bit, uh, uh yeah. <laughs> so, come on, let's get back into it. All right. So, if I remember correctly, we're supposed to take that, um, box, I'm gonna call it, up to the tower. Okay, let's go. It feels nice to sit down and to play the game, like, after everything, you know, like, after a long day of, um, work, school, jiu-jitsu, gym, working out, all that stuff. It's nice to just, uh, forget about what is going on and just getting lost in a good game. Can I go up this way? I can. Hey, don't don't forget these squishy things. Ugh, I hate them. I hate them. Let's see. Yuck. Okay. Up here. Yeah, I um I like playing this game. It's definitely fun. I like the aesthetic. I like the feel to it. The cat's adorable. You can't argue that. Oh, hell no. Nope. 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 Okay, got away. Hmm. But yeah, I didn't forget about you guys. It's kind of hard, you know, to forget about you guys. Um, and I definitely, you know, it wasn't like I wasn't wanting to record this. Like, trust me, I've tried and I've gone through a lot of frustration to get this, hopefully, up and running so you guys can enjoy it. So, I care. <laughs> All right, what? Okay, so apparently they've got floating beer bottles in this game. I wish there was a way I could smack it. <laughs> That's an odd glitch. Um, okay. All right, which way am I supposed to go? Ah, aha. This way. Then I jump back up here. Let's see. Ah, back down there. I like the way you could jump on things too. Like, how to, it's just um, like jumping on the beams that move to get to another location. Um, I would never try that in real life. I am not very coordinated. I mean, I am when I'm very focused, especially like in jujitsu when I'm. You know, focused, I'm coordinated, but everyday life, I'm running into walls 
literally I smack my hip into every corner in in the kitchen it's just uh yeah I trip fall I got weak ass ankles so I I'm trying to work on that okay if I had the grace of a cat whoo be unstoppable okay I want to say I hit this button but I could be wrong all right so we jump over here ah no it's not the squishies not the squishies no means no no jump back over jump back over kitty oh goodness okay all right you open it i run that's your job Aha. one thing about this um the whole area like the red gooey stuff on the walls reminds me of stranger things which i finally got to season three watched it good season now i gotta finish this series but yeah that's what this reminds me of am i the only one still creeping but cool looking at the same time okay uh here yeah look at that so cool i mean red's my favorite color but even this is a lot of red just a little bit just only a little bit see that's cool I can't remember what's that phobia I think I have it where you can't look at too many holes that are together it 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 like just I don't know it makes me cringe and feel like weird I'm just like Ugh. no I can't look at it is it, is it tri trichophobia or something like that triple phobia it's something like that but I think I have it like I can't look at anything with like too many holes especially like in the skin like like a flesh-eating bacteria I can't do it nope mm -mm. Gross. Okay. I think I go up here. Knock you down. And let's go in through here. Ah! Nope. Nobody, nope. Ooh. I can hear it too. Every time the cat steps on steps on like the squishy stuff or the red stuff, I I can hear it right in my ear hole. Mm. Okay. Gonna be more of those squishy things. I guess if I remember we're supposed to lure them. No 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 no. I think I want you guys to come over. Oh oh, so you're quick. Okay. Ah, you you are very quick. Jump, 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 jump. Haha, <laughs> miss me. I'm meowing. Come this way. Jump to freedom. Okay. Is there any over there? Ah, they're in there. So... My guess is I have to get them over there. So let's go open the door. Run! Not a run, but, you know, walk fastly away. Come this way. I'm over here. 
Okay, it's kind of funny that some of them just fell off. Oh, no, 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 no. Shake it off. Shake it off. Okay. Nope. No, no. No, 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 no. How? 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 <laughs> okay. Get up here. Ah! Oh. No, no, I hate restarting. Why did I have to go so far back? I was up there. Oh, they're right there waiting. Okay. Do your thing. Okay, here's a barrel. here I'm gonna go over here and yeah and see what happens yes all of you come this way haha -ha. you know I can hear him squishing in my ear I'm also afraid of heights just a little bit which is funny because I'm like super duper tall but, uh, yeah, that, that makes me uncomfortable looking down. <laughs> okay. Alright. We need to go up. Here they come. Okay. Uh, go this way. I'm just gonna try to go around in circles and avoid them. Ah! Shake it off, shake it off. Just keep going. You got this. Are they jumping out the sides? <laughs> All right. I'm trying to remember what I called the little robot. B. Transceiver. Yeah, that's what it was. The transceiver on the antenna. You got it. This thing. That's taking a very long time to light up. But it's a cool view. Look, the view, it's beautiful from here. I remember now the city, it was meant to be a shelter. Those look like stars, but they're only lights mark marking the hermetic roof ceiling off the city. Humankind built this shell to protect themselves from the outside, but it came at a cost. Nobody can go out. The outside was a disaster, completely barren, unlivable, and dangerous. But if you come from there, it must mean it's safe again. 
And my promise wasn't just to go to the outside, it was to open the city. That's a big promise. I still don't understand why some memories are coming back and others aren't. But I'm certain now this is my purpose. I have to open the city. Come on, let's go back and find Momo. Now that we've connected the transmitter, we should be able to get help. You've got it, little bossy robot. Looks so cute in his little bucket. We're back! Gotta clean ourselves after that, uh, squishy disaster. Ugh. Yes. Little outsider, if you're reading this, that means you're still alive. Excellent! He, he, he had no doubt. I took some equipment to the bar to take advantage of their antenna. Come meet me there. I've locked the window, but the code is open is quite simple. It is... Very simple. Yep. Be careful, it is case sensitive. <laughs> you see at the bar. Momo, see you at the bar. That must be the code for the window near the entrance. Let's go. Alright. Here's the lock for the window. The code was... Mm, it was the H, I think? Error, wrong key. Whoops, my bad. Okay, let's try that again. Hmm. And then it was O, or was it a zero? Let's see. Success! It worked. Momo's at the bar waiting for us. Alright. Let's see if we can go find Momo. So let me think. Let me think. I think I have to go down. No, I said down, not up. Why is your face like that? Why you look so mean? Oh, hey, it's you. You do look weird and small, but that's something about you. Excuse you? You don't just call people weird. But then again, I think I did, right? I feel compelled to pet you, but I won't because I don't understand why. <laughs> Welcome to being a human of pets. No, good jump that way. And go down here. Go down. No, stop going up when I'm saying down. Go down. There we go. Go down. Go down. Haha. -ha. Bar. What does this say? Elliot programming. Wait, let me read the signs first. That might be helpful. Maybe it's this way. Wait. Aha, I found it. There he is. Hey, little furball. Come here, I managed to get a signal. I'm just running into people, man. Oh, you want me to come up there. Okay, you got it. Let me see if I can get this thing working. <laughs> I've almost got it. Hello. Can anyone hear me? Hello, yes, we can hear you. We're from the slums. We're looking for a way out and... Wait, is that... I'm gonna say Z because I don't know how to say that. Momo? I, I can't believe it. I'm so happy to hear your voice, Z. Where are you? Are the others okay? Yes, we are safe. We found a way up. Hello? Do you still hear me? You have to go through the sewers to reach us. Very dangerous. Zerks everywhere. Sewers, how? Hello. Darn it, we've lost the signal. 
I can't believe it. Z is alive. He and the other outsiders managed to go up through the sewers. The sewers are the most dangerous place in the slums, but if Z made it, there must be a way. You'll never get past the sewers if the best of the Zerks, they'll make a quick meal out of you, especially you, little one. Many tried their luck in the past, it doesn't end well. Anyway, I warned you, your business is none of my business. Well, okay then. Why were you eavesdropping then? Seamus. His father, Doc, used to be a great scientist. He was working on some new weapon to fight the Zerks. A few years ago, he went off to test the device and never came back. Seamus has seen- has never been the same since. Don't listen to Seamus, he's just scared like I was. If Doc built a weapon, that's our ticket to join the outsiders. In his notebook, Doc mentioned a secret lab a few times. That must be where he was working on it. There might be a clue in Seamus' apartment. Come on, follow me. Like his little robe, very tropical looking. The pink flamingos. At least they still got style. Come on, Seamus, open the door. You know your father would have wanted to help us. Well, that was to be expected. The situation's pretty tough on Seamus. He doesn't want to hear about the outsiders anymore. He won't help me. But you... I think I have an idea. And I think I know what that idea is. You're gonna have me break in and do your dirty work. Here, take Doc's notebook and show it to Seamus. Gained. It contains a lot of information that will hopefully act as an electroshock. Find the secret lab, little outsider. I'm going back to the bar to try to establish communication with the others. Okay. We caught on right away. What are you doing in here? I told you, getting through the series is a suicide mission. Leave me be. Well, I got something for you. What's this? Wait, is this my papa's? Oh wow, I never knew. There's a secret room here in our flat, but where? I'm not gonna say it's obvious, but um, it's pretty obvious. There's a door shape square here. Conveniently in the wall. Uh, hi yeah. Did that just throw me across the room? Wait, what just happened? Did I die? Did the photo just kill me? Wait, what just happened? I think, I think it crashed. <laughs> oh, wonderful. Oh, Wh what? Wait, hold up, back up. I just, I fell through the map. I fell through the map. <laughs> A picture threw me through the map. Oh no. Well, I just fixed certain d difficulties. Technical difficulties just to have this happen. Wonderful. Great. Beautiful. Ah, love it. Okay, well, I think I'm gonna end it there.
and hopefully try to get this this figured out so we can pick up where we left off in part four. Thank you guys for joining. <laughs> like and subscribe. Okay guys, I'm gonna have to leave it there. Unfortunately, I did record more of this video and no joke, I, I somehow, or the game somehow, glitched my cat out of the game. I went to touch something and it slingshotted the cat out into the oblivion. <laughs> and I recorded it, but the, uh, like, the recordings glitched. It glitched the same time the cat did. The same time the cat got glitched out of the game, my recording got glitched. So, luckily most of the recordings salvageable. I'll just show up until before the glitch. It was really, really funny. I wish that the recording got it because I would have loved to have showed you guys how funny that was. But yeah, I'm gonna end. I'm gonna end the video here. I hope you guys enjoy, and hopefully I can get this figured out correctly and keep posting more content for you guys. I hope you enjoy. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.